The Castilla County Sheriff's Office confirms to 13 investigates one of their former officers has been arrested by the FBI for kidnapping a Vermont man in a murder for hire plot. Investigative reporter Sean Rice is live in our newsroom tonight with what federal prosecutors are saying. Sean. Yeah, Heather, arrest documents say Jerry Banks of Fort Garland, Colorado, was allegedly hired by two men to kill Gregory Davis of Vermont back in January of 2018. Banks went as far as posing as a uniformed U.S. Marshal to kidnap Davis from his home, but it would seem there's not enough evidence at this time to charge Banks with murder, which is how this case in Vermont ended. Arrest documents obtained by 13 investigates reveal a man identified as Jerry Banks allegedly showed up to the house of a Vermont man with handcuffs and a rifle, wearing a jacket with a U.S. Marshal emblem. According to Greg Davis's wife, Banks told him he had a warrant for his arrest. Prosecutors further allege that Banks made a phone call to 911 that night, January 6, 2018. In the call, they say Banks pretended to be Davis and told 911 operators that he had shot his wife and was going to shoot himself. But a pair of cell phones is what allowed detectives to connect Banks to the incident. Investigators say one phone was purchased at an address in Oak Grove, Missouri. That phone was then pinged in Monta Vista, Colorado at the end of December before being tracked in multiple states across the country. Missouri, Illinois, Indiana, Ohio, and two states on the East Coast, Massachusetts and Vermont. The last ping coming the night Davis went missing at a location in Danville, Vermont. The other phone, the one used to call 911 that night, pinged in Danville and was allegedly bought by Banks at a Walmart in Clearfield, Pennsylvania on January 5th. On his way back to Colorado, prosecutors say he was stopped on a highway in Kansas. During the stop, officers say he was driving a white Ford Explorer and had a gun, tactical vest, and law enforcement equipment inside his SUV. He was released from that traffic stop. But over four years later, on April 6, 2022, Banks was arrested at Yellowstone National Park, where he was working at the time on federal kidnapping charges. Banks has pleaded not guilty to the kidnapping charges. Two men, the two men allegedly who allegedly Banks paid Banks to kill Davis, have also been charged with conspiring to use interstate commerce in the commission of a murder for hire. Reporting in the newsroom, Sean Rice, 13 Investigates. All right, Sean, thank you.